This piece is one of the first rugged individual pieces that I painted. When you put a red dress on, I don't know why women think, okay, I know who I am. I fit this red dress. I fit into this piece. That's what you do when you find yourself. You're always wearing a red dress. This piece is a self-portrait of me. So my image of myself, my very unique self, and I painted this because um, there's a wonderful story behind this blue dress. When I was small, I got a lot of hand-me-downs and my mom did sewing and she made me some wonderful outfits that she thought were absolutely super and I hated. And one time when she was away for a holiday, the babysitter said we could pick out anything we wanted and I picked out a blue dress. And it was a beautiful blue dress. It was really baby blue, it wasn't dark blue, but that's an artist's interpretation. And she bought me white patent shoes, and she bought me some, my first pair of nylons. The dress was made out of a very, very thin material. And I wore it to church for that holiday. And my Sunday school class got up in front of the whole congregation, it was a big congregation, and we sang some songs for the holiday. Well, I was right in front because I was always the shortest. I had the red hair that always stood out. Don't know what happened to it. I felt like the woman in the red dress. I felt special. It was my first store-bought dress. Well, when my mother got home and she saw what we purchased for the holiday and wore to church, she was aghast that I would wear that blue dress because it wasn't something that she would have made for me. Um, she wasn't something I should wear to church, according to her. And the worst part of it all was that the nylons that I was able to buy were knee-high nylons. And she said, you don't wear stockings like that and you're not old enough to wear stockings. It's a good story, I love the story, and it's part of what made me a rugged individual.